Welcome to my summer clothing haul. It's a very special occasion, so cheers. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. It is the best time of the year, not for my wallet, obviously, but for my heart. And that's what matters, okay? I have been waiting to do this video for months, and if you know me, you know that hauls are part of who I am and who this channel is. I haven't been doing them as much because it's definitely slowed down a lot. I went off the deep end into YouTube last night and I started watching some of my old hauls. I'm doing a back to school clothing haul. I'm going into my senior year. That ain't it, but this is. So I have a bunch of clothes to show you guys. I'm so excited for this haul. I hope you guys are too, so let's get into it. Let's start off with the most unsummer thing ever sweatpants. When am I gonna wear these? I don't know because it is so hot here. See that? That's not highlighter. That is indeed sweat. But I thought these were so cute. This is from Max Rue. Hopefully I'm saying that right, but I found them through Instagram. So I wanted to support a smaller business. Colors are so cute. Yellow, pink, and blue. They're more lightweight. And I think I sized up in this just to have more of an oversized fit. I have no idea when I'm going to wear this. I think these are super cool because let's be honest, I'm going to be in my house a lot. <laughs> I picked up a few things from Aritzia. The first one being this box bodysuit, a little thong bodysuit, which is honestly very convenient. It doesn't have the clips at the bottom, so when you pee, you kind of just have to like either one get naked or pull it to the side, which is slightly inconvenient, but the cut of this is so beautiful, it is worth it. It's this beautiful deep v-neck, which is so flattering, and honestly, I just love bodysuits. I love the way their bodysuits fit me, and the material is so, so nice. Love this. And I also got another bodysuit. This one is a square neckline in this lime color, which I think is so pretty. I kind of want to get into more wearing green, like the one I'm wearing now. I just think it's such a pretty color. I love straight necklines because it shows off your decolletage. I'm going to show it off while I can. If you have a collarbone, why not show it off, right? Bodysuits are great because you can just throw on a pair of shorts and call it a day. And the last thing that I picked up from Ritzia was this very darling little square neck top, kind of similar to the one I'm wearing now, I guess, because the sleeves have that puffy feel to them. I just love how it's ribbed. It has that cute little bow in the front. Very darling, very innocent. That is the goal. I picked up two things from Lulu's. I've never been one to really wear cover-ups or anything, but I thought these were so, so... Eh, I don't want to say cute. Adorable, fun, fresh. They kind of have like a tie-dye look to them. I love these pants. These are kind of see-through, which is fine because it's just to wear over a bikini. Yeah, I thought the color was so cool. I don't own anything like this. I thought I would change things up a bit and get this. And then, this is something that I wouldn't normally get, but I just thought it was so... Mm. I just thought this was a cool piece. It's kind of sheer, like I said. It doesn't do that much. It doesn't cover that much because it is so sheer, but... It's the thought that counts, and I really liked how it was kind of tie-dyed. Just something to throw on. The hair is going up, it is way too hot. What would a 2020 clothing haul look like without hauling a mask? Who would have thought? Not me, I had very high hopes going into this year, but whatever. Putting that aside, I thought because it's clear that where I live, we're gonna have to wear masks for a while, and I kind of want to do that anyways just because I feel better. If I'm going to have to wear a mask, it might as well be cute. So I found this one through one of the black owned businesses that you can support. I found this one. It's called Sabrina Haying Vintage. I hope I'm saying that right. Look how adorable this little mask is. And what's really awesome is that it came with a filter that you can put in, which is super cool. And these are reusable, washable. This is so cute. Anyways, got a mask. Speaking of black owned businesses, I found one that I really, really liked through one of the Instagram threads that I saw. I'm super picky about swimsuits that I wear, but I really wanted to try this one out. The company is called Jade Swim. It's black owned. And what I loved is that it's also sustainably made, which is so, so cool. They have really nice swimsuits on their website. They're more plain, which I like to have some more plain ones. So the first bikini that I got from them is this bandeau style top, pretty much just a piece of fabric, but I can tell this is made very nicely. It's double lined and I love the color. I feel like this complements my skin very well. If you're new to my channel, hello, I'm Ava and I wear cheeky bikinis. It's a thing. And if that bothers you, I'm sorry, but got some bottoms. <laughs> They're the matching ones. These are definitely tiny, but again, I'm not getting any younger, so might as well wear this while I can. So I really liked that set, and I liked it so much, I picked it up in the blue color. These ones were actually on sale, so these were so much cheaper. And also, when I bought these, the whole site was having 20% off, so you really gotta look out for salespeople, because especially during Corona time, there is a lot of sales going on on most websites. The blue bottoms that I got are a little bit bigger, so they're not as cheeky, which it's good to have options sometimes. And I also 
also would like to say that if you do buy from them, they run very small, so just keep that in mind. And the top is just that same bandeau style, which is not good for water sports, but it's great for tanning, so bada boom. I feel like a full-on bride when I wear it, and you might be like, Ava, what is that? What is that? Basically, to make a long story short, it's a one piece that has like a cutout, but with a bow. You guys will see in the try on, it's so flattering. What I love is that it makes my boobs look really great. And also the color white for swimsuits is just so flattering on everyone I feel like. So it is a little dangerous, but I'm willing to take that risk. This one piece is beautiful. I got another one from Acacia Swim. This is a really popular brand in Hawaii and you might be like, Ava, what is this? What does it look like? I love this print. I already have matching bottoms with a different top. So I thought I would get this style top. It's so, so pretty. Basically wraps around and it's a bandeau style. I just love this print. Such beautiful hibiscus flowers and I just love the colors. Let's take a little break from bikinis. I'll show you guys some more clothes. I may or may not have done some damage at Urban Outfitters. It is a curse. I swear I need to unsubscribe from their notifications because I always get these little pop-ups on my phone that are like 30% off sale, these new things are back in stock. And I'm just like, I need you now. And then I buy it, which is not a good cycle. And I'm really trying to break that. I got all these things a while ago, so they have been marinating in my closet for a bit. First thing I'm gonna show you are from their Urban Renewal line, which is their sustainable line. It's been around for quite a while and they have some really cool vintage and redone stuff on there. The first piece are these Levi shorts. I love Levi shorts. I actually think they just cut these. They used to be jeans, but they made them into shorts. So that's really cool. These are a little bit big. They do run small, but I like sized up a little too much, I guess. It's a little big around my waist, which is fine because usually when I wear shorts in the summer, I don't want it to cling to my thighs because it's very triggering when you're sitting on a seat or in your car and your thighs are sweating and you're in tight jean shorts. That is just the worst thing ever. So I actually like that these are a little bit loose. Also from that Urban Renewal line, you guys might've seen this because I posted an Instagram picture in it and this is so comfy. It's a tie-dye sweatshirt i think it's so cool the colors are just so majestic they remind me of a beautiful sunset and i just thought that was really beautiful it's a bit oversized on me which i really like and it's just so so comfortable and then i picked up two shirts from that same urban renewal line the first one is kind of a tie-dyed shirt but it's not super in your face tie-dye which i really like because that can kind of be overwhelming sometimes this one is in this really nice rose color it's a bit oversized which is really nice you can tie it up you can wear it just as a big t-shirt, tuck it into some shorts or some jeans, although I don't know many people who wear jeans during summer because that ain't it. Only on very special occasions will you see that happen. And the other t-shirt that I got is not as oversized. It's this light yellow color. You can't go wrong with a plain t-shirt. Moving on to the regular stuff from Urban. This silky long sleeve with the tie in the front is so, so flattering. I have it in this green color and I was so obsessed with it, so I wanted to get it in this cream color. You just wear a cute little bralette and under it, you let the skin show. It's so beautiful. It's my last summer as a teenager because next summer I will be 20. Now that I have that mindset, everything's starting to click, okay? I thought this tiny little bodysuit was so cute. It's in this lime color. It's one of those thong bodysuits. It has a plunging neckline, which again, is so flattering. You could just wear this with a little bra or no bra if that's your style. For me, they're a little they're a little too big for that, so I'd probably wear like a lace bralette with this or something. I just thought the color was really fun, bright, and cute. I got two mini dresses because it was necessary. If we're gonna have a fun summer, a mini dress has to be involved. This one is so different from anything that I own. It's this beautiful pattern um, and it fits so well. What I love about this is that it's not super form-fitting. I can still shake and move my thing, which is great. I don't like dresses that make me feel restricted especially dresses that I can't eat in because I could definitely eat like a five course meal in this and not feel trapped. So this is really, really perfect. And the material is so nice. Literally feel that. It's so thick and it just feels like such good quality. So I'm really excited about this. I don't think I took a try on clip for this, but you're just gonna have to take my word that this is very cute. I'll probably post an Instagram picture on it. So stay tuned. We'll see. This is just a tan mini dress and it's so flattering. Again, it fits so well and I just needed another mini dress. That is that. And of course, to finish off the clothing part of this video, I got two big t-shirts. That's all I've been living in during this quarantine. I feel like my life is just a cycle of me wearing one big t-shirt to the next, but it's been great. I love it. I love not wearing pants. I just feel like a free woman. First one is this light blue color. It has this cool, I don't even know. I never even looked at the writing on it, but it's pretty Pretty cool just this light blue color it's very oversized on me which I really like it's just super easy to throw on call it a day 
And the other one that I got is this beautiful teal color. I just thought this color was so nice and interesting. It's got this fish on it, which is pretty cool, I guess. I just really liked the color and I love big t-shirts. That's all I want in life is a big t-shirt and I'll be happy. Those are all the clothes. Now I'm gonna show you the rest of the bikinis that I got because did I just do a bikini haul not that long ago? Yes. I, I don't need to explain this. I wanted to shout out Kulani's Kinis. They always send me their super cute bikinis and they're always so sweet and I love their stuff. This one is probably one of my favorite bikinis from them. I love the underwire bra style. I think it's really nice. It also supports my boobs that I don't want just like flopping around out there. So this is really nice. It has adjustable straps, which is great. The color, the patterns are just so, so pretty and the bottoms are obviously matching. They're a bit cheeky. Love, love, love the set. So big shout out to them, a huge thank you. And the last bikinis I'm gonna show you guys are from Frankie's. The first one, it, you know, I, mm, it's a little bit questionable and I understand that. Um, mostly because I look naked when I'm wearing it. Not because it's super skimpy, but because it's nude. When I put this on, I was like, I look like I'm not wearing clothes. I think it's so cool how it has that cut out. It gives a little under boob, which again, how many times am I gonna say this? It's my last summer as a teenager, so let's go all out. And the bottoms are just these really nice cheeky bottoms. They're not super tight, which I like, so it just sits really nicely on the hips and the waist. Magnifique. The other bikini that I got, I was, I was taking a bit of a risk with them. White bikinis scare me because you just never know. The bottoms are the same style as that tan one and as much as the white color scares me, I'm willing to take that risk. So I love, love that. And the top that I got, um, you know, might not be everyone's cup of tea, but I love how it has kind of a similar boob cut out to the other one, except this one's adjustable so you can open it up, you can close it, it's great. So yes, I'm super excited to wear these. And the last thing of this haul, one of my favorite things that I got is this lavender set, also from Frankie's. The bottoms are not as tiny as the rest of them, so these are really nice. They sit really nicely on the hips and it has this little extra fabric, which is just really nice and it helps the confidence a lot just because it covers a little bit more and it lays really nicely on your body. So it doesn't cut into anything and these are just really, really nice bottoms. The top is my favorite. It's so cute. It's this ribbed material. It has adjustable straps. The back has a little thinner strap. I just thought this was such a cute set. And that is it. <laughs> So that was my summer 2020 clothing haul slash bikini haul, I guess. It's been a minute since I done one and it was really fun. So I hope you guys had a good time watching. Hopefully this gives you some inspiration. Make sure you follow me on Instagram because I will show you guys how I style a lot of these pieces on there. If you stay to this point in the video, comment down below the peach emoji. If you didn't know, I have a vlog channel, which I've been super active on and it's been really fun to vlog my day-to-day -day life. Thank you for watching this video. I am very hot and I am sweating. Love you guys and I'll see you in my next video.